Yes, absolutely, absolutely, my friends. What's going on, everybody? This is Luke Pico with IroncladConfidence.com. Coming to you guys today, baby. Just wanted to freaking rock some amazing insights. Share with you some powerful concepts, dude, on what's going on in reality, what's going on with people, with certain individuals, and what you can expect when you start learning the power of attraction. And so, if you guys are new here to the channel, you guys, this is a freestyle video today, baby. I usually don't do videos like this, dude. I'm usually doing videos like out in nature, out at the park, out at, you know, Hart Park, dude, or, you know, in a house somewhere, you know, doing stuff like that, right? <laughs> yeah, buddy, baby, so check it out, my friends. If you want to learn about some deep concepts, if you want to learn about real world experience, because this that's what I jaw drop on this channel, baby. I jaw drop real world powerful concepts, powerful insights on how reality works. And when you start to investigate and decode the secrets of reality, when you start to decode the power of universal laws of energy and what's going on behind the scenes of reality, you're going to start to experience a completely different shift in your reality, a completely different reality. It's going to blow your mind, dude. Guaranteed, baby. <laughs> yeah, buddy, baby. And so, you guys, I'm going to share some concepts with you right now on how you know for a fact that you're becoming more and more successful in life because these laws, these invisible electromagnetic laws of attraction, they are real, dude. They are so real and so many people are asleep and they don't even know it. And so here's the thing, baby. So some of the things that I've learned about the law of attraction and quantum physics, which is what I talk about on this channel too, is that you got to understand something about reality, dude. So we work with what is called the quantum field of potential, the quantum field of reality. And guess what, dude? The quantum field of reality, you're using the five senses to basically absorb the electrical data, the energetic frequency of all the information around you, dude. <laughs> you got hearing, you got sight, you got taste, you got touch, and you got smell, dude. Those are the five quantum tools. And then you have a sixth, one, two, three, four, five, sixth, a sixth sense called your emotional powerhouse, okay? And guess what, baby? Your subconscious mind stores the subconscious electromagnetic energy inside of you. You understand that? Most people, oh brother, another another law of attraction guru. Guess what, dude? It's real, buddy. Whether you acknowledge it or not, whether you like it or not, because as much as you think upon a thought, you are thinking upon the attraction laws of that frequency. Rewind, say it again. <laughs> Whatever you think about, baby, you are thinking on the electromagnetic laws of that reality. And here's what's crazy. When you're starting to get successful, when you're starting to gain momentum in your the hero's journey, can you hear the call, hero? <laughs> when you're going through this hero's journey or when you're going through this success process in order to develop who you are and your character and become your highest potential, your greatest version, you are going to carry a freaking electromagnetic frequency of energy with you and other people who are not on that same frequency, you, you got to understand something. You're going to have a whole boatload, a whole freaking bunch of people who they don't like you dude they don't like you you're gonna have to freaking you're gonna have to accept that and i'm telling you this from experience from from straightforward experience and guess what the people closest to you don't be fooled baby don't be fooled by their games because see the people closest to you they will freaking turn on you dude they will freaking play games with you. They will not like you. It's not that they're bad. They're just freaking, you know, they can't help themselves, dude. They can't help themselves because they're not on your level of energy, baby. <laughs> and so guess what? They're going to play games. They're going to they're gonna try to, you know, do things and all this other stuff. And you just got to recognize that. 
and that's important because see if you're if you're on if you're on you know you're on the freaking you know going to the freaking top and those people they ain't training like you train guess what dude they're not gonna like it baby it's a, it's a hard hitting truth dude a lot of people they don't want to they don't want to hear the truth and so guess what they're gonna push away from you they're not gonna like you they're gonna all kinds of stuff it's games dude this is how it goes but guess what? At the same time, you're going to attract the right people. I talk about this all the time. I'm only looking for people who are looking for me, dude. That's it. <laughs> and, and mind you, I ain't talking about just looking for you because there's plenty of people when you start to become successful, they're going to want to, you know, they'll look for you, but they don't really have good intentions. They just, they have different intentions, dude. Their intentions are, you know, to play games. Because see, a lot of people, they live from a space of envy they live from a space of jealousy. They live from a space of ego. They live from a space of insecurity and negativity. And so, because they live from that space, guess what, dude? You're gonna, they're gonna try to project all their doubts and fears and insecurities onto you. And you gotta recognize that, baby, because guess what? This is a game of transformation. Most people don't spend their life trying to transform who they are from the inside out, baby. You understand that? <laughs> they don't. They don't spend their lifetime to trying to transform who they are from the inside out. Most people, you guys, and I know, and this ain't me trying to make it difficult on you, because guess what? I came from there, dude. I came from the same freaking, you know, the same stream of information. You get raised, you get programmed, and you don't even know it. You're picking up all kinds of data, you're picking up all kinds of information from the outside world. This is how to do it. This is what it is. This, you know. And then you get locked into that program, not even knowing it's a professional gram, a program of information, right? <laughs> yeah, buddy. This is the way it goes, my friends. This is the way it goes. And because you get you get programmed with that information, guess what? You get basically vaporized with all of that reality not even knowing that you could flip it up you could flip it and reverse it baby you could change it you can you can create something amazing in your life but you got to understand something just like you have I see everyone has attractive energy everyone's using the quantum field every day you can't you can't experience reality you don't exist without the quantum tools hearing sight taste touch smell and your emotions you don't exist did you know that what do you mean I don't exist? Listen listen to me, my friends. You cannot absorb, you cannot digest any information, any energy without those tools that I just shared with you. Your eyes pick up information. Your, your ears pick up information. When you eat food, you are eating, literally eating in formation. Right? Creation, right? You're, you're literally eating information. Food is information. And guess what? Thoughts are information for the mind. <laughs> That's the way it goes, dude. See, your thoughts are electrical, baby. Your thoughts are electrical, dude. Your emotions, they are magnetic. So, you got electrical thoughts and magnetic emotions. That means you got electromagnetic power of intelligence living inside of you and you don't even know it. And here's what's crazy. Those emotions, those emojis, dude, guess what? They carry a magnetic frequency to them. That magnetic frequency is what is called the law of attraction. And these are not man-made laws. These are not man-made laws. And it, you can that's why you can't argue with it. Because see, gravity is a law. It's a universal law. You can't argue with the fact that gravity is real. <laughs> gravity holds you to the surface of the earth, baby. That's gravity. Guess what? You're breathing in the oxygen. Guess what? It's an invisible gas that you breathe in. That's a law. You can't argue with that. When you feel the wind blow on your arms, guess what? You, you feel it on your subconscious body, but you can't see it. You can't taste the wind. You just feel it. So there's evidence that it's real. You see what I'm saying? And guess what? All, all your reality comes from the thoughts that you think, the words that you speak, and the emotional power that you carry with you from day to day. And a lot of people live life, they don't even know that. They don't even know that, baby, because they're too caught up in the 3D world. 
Mind you, we're all caught up in the 3D world, but guess what? If you live from the 3D world and never learn about, you know, what's going on behind the scenes in the fifth dimension, in the invisible world, guess what, dude? You don't know what's cracking, baby. You don't truly know what's going on. That's why I I decided to send myself on a learning journey, dude. <laughs> I decided to send myself on a learning journey. I decided to crack the freaking code. I decided to boss myself around and to give myself permission to magnify and amplify the powers of attraction in my life. But see, here's the thing. You're already attracting certain things into your life. You have to. By law of nature, you have to. See, the simple fact you've attracted into your life the house you have, the cars you have, the clothes you have, the people, the friends, the relatives, all of that stuff, you attract them into your life. Good and bad, positive and negative, happy and sad, you attract everything into your life. See, this is powerful because, let me let me explain to you why. Because at the same time that you're trying to, you're attracting these things into your life, that's at the same time, you're also attracting all the other negative energies that are around. Because we live in a world that is governed, that's governed by a polarity. You see what I'm saying? (laughs) We live in a world that is governed by a polarity. Okay? And the polarity is this. Positive and negative. You can positively attract good events in your life, but you can also positively attract negativity into your life, and you don't even know it. Most people don't know that, baby. They don't know that. So guess what? What are you attracting into your life, right? It's easier said than done because as your attraction power grows, so does the negativity. You see what I'm saying? And so it's a good indicator to recognize that the more negative things get from time to time, that's actually an indicator of how successful you're becoming in life. It's just that most people, because they don't know that, they don't don't even recognize, dude. They don't even recognize that, hey, you know what? They can keep moving in the direction of success. You see what I'm saying? (laughs) They don't recognize that. And so guess what? You start attracting what is called Decepticons. Decepticonic energies. Decepticonic influences. Decepticonic people. And they don't even know it. This is what's crazy. They don't even know it. But so guess what? You attract that into your reality. You start picking up all of that stuff. It starts to have an effect on you. Because we also live in a world of cause and effect, dude. (laughs) That's the world we live in. We live in a world of cause and effect. And guess what? These gamers, they'll try and play games. They'll try to plant doubt inside of you. They'll try to make you think that you're the one going crazy. And it's really sad because they don't even know that the freaking creator is the one who's working through you to help them unlock their own mind. They don't even know that, baby. And so guess what? Because you shine so brightly, they can't stand. You can't they can't stand how you shine, dude. Your light is too bright. I told I talked about this in my freaking podcast. People care way too much about what other people think about them. People care way too much about who that, you know, if people are looking at them a certain way. You're not going to believe it, dude. It don't matter. People are going they're not you. They don't have to live with you. They get to live their own life. And so guess what? If you spend your life worrying about what other people are thinking of you, guess what? Doesn't that mean they're the ones controlling who you are? Your identity, your personality, your happiness, your your motivation, your enthusiasm. You see what I'm saying here, dude? (laughs) It's the way it goes, baby. This is why it's important to stand guard at your mind. Because too many people, they just, they get taken over. They get taken over by negative energies. Oh, forget it. I can't even live up to that. So they, you know, this is how people get when you start to shine. When you start to get real fucking confident. When you start to fucking get real, you know, magnificent in your understanding about who you are. People around you, especially, I'm not necessarily, I'm I'm talking about people who are in your immediate presence. Those are the dangerous ones that you don't even know. It's hidden in plain sight because they got people like that. They don't know what to do. They just got different energies. And because they don't understand you, guess what? They play games. They play games. They like to, because they think they're going to make you doubt. 
They think they're going to make you, they're looking for an opening, but they don't understand that the creator the whole time is the, the, the opening from the beginning. <laughs> Dang, dude. It's the way it goes. It's the way it goes. And so guess what? When you learn to elevate your level of awareness, you gain more mastery over your mind. You gain more mastery over who you believe you are. And then you get to disengage from that energy. You see what I'm saying? Because see, here's the thing. People who are close to you, they don't mean bad, but they just don't know. So they subconsciously, they start taking it out on you. They start pulling away from you or they come, they get real close to you. And so it's all part, it's all part of, of the agenda, baby. It's all part of the game that they play. And you just got to recognize it for what it is. You can't control another person, dude. You can't make another person. I mean, yeah, you can temporarily control them or manipulate them if they're not aware. But for the most part, you cannot control another person. Like, try to live for them and make them do this exactly like this. Because people have their own brains. And people don't, you know, they're not going to... If they don't link up with you, guess what? That's not your problem. This is why it's so important. This is why sometimes you got to you gotta be willing... See, to go to the next level, you have to be willing to accept the fact that there's just people that can't go with you to the top. There's just people that can't go with you to the top. And it becomes evident over time. It becomes evident. The people closest to you, they can't all go, dude. It's just the way it goes. <laughs> They're on a different pathway. They're on a different frequency. And guess what? Because you're you're a freaking lighthouse and your freaking energy shines brighter, guess what? They're not going to like it. So they're going to they're just not going to like it so they'll play games to try and hold you back. This is extremely extremely important, dude. I'm just saying, I had to say this now because today was a pretty good day for me, but at the same time, you got to you got to pay attention. I see I focus on the on the the field of energy. I focus on the world of energy, dude. That's where everything happens at. That's where everything is at. And so, who do you want to be? What do you want to do? You don't got to be with people who who are going to try and play games with you. You don't got to be with those people. Well, I know it's easier said than done because they're, they're loved. They're your loved ones. They're this, they're that. But you got to understand, dude, not all of them have the same vision as you. Not all of them can go with you to the top because they don't see themselves that way. In fact, a lot of them, they'll try to hold you back by using deception on you. But hey, you can't, you got to just, you got to do what you got to do. These laws are powerful, powerful, universal laws that you're already using in your life right now. What do you want to do, dude? Who do you want to be, buddy? Who do you want to be, mama? You see what I'm saying? For me, I had to, I had to decide this is who I'm going to be. This is what I'm going to do. And I'm not going to settle until I reach success. Because when you go through enough pain in life, see, life teaches you all kinds of lessons. And if you don't learn those lessons sooner than later, then a lot of people, they just give up on life. Well, uh, I've already spent this many years creating all this pain. Forget it. This is who I am. I can't do it. Whatever. <laughs> I'm like, hell no, buddy. I'm out of here, dude. I'm going to freaking break free. I'm going to go to a different level. I'm going to I'm going to grow. I'm going to outgrow everyone around me. But you got to be willing to accept that. Because see, the right people, the right, right people, they will be attracted towards you. They will learn. They will, they will freaking, they will be, they will be with you and, you know, add increase to your life. They will add motivation to your life. They will add inspiration to your life. They will add that to your life. And the people who don't want to be around you, who don't like you, guess what? First of all, that's none of your business. Second of all, it don't matter what they think. Because guess what? I'm only looking for people who are looking for me. I'm only talking to people who want to hear what I have to say. Because guess what? I've been there. I've done that. I cracked the code. <laughs> I cracked the code. Why do you think I do videos? Why do you think I rocked a podcast this morning? Because... It's a new level, dude. It's a new level of reality. And guess what? Certain people, they just can't go with you. In fact, you're going to have to cut certain people off because, you know, they can't handle it. Because, it, or, or maybe you can't handle it because if you're moving towards success and they're not going in that direction, guess what, dude? They're going to play games with you. They're going to play games and then they're going to say, oh, I wasn't playing a game. 
oh, I wasn't this, oh, I wasn't that. No, they're gamers. They're playing games. Because they see who you are and what you're doing and where you're going. So guess what? They start getting jealous. They start getting envious. No, but I'm not jealous, but they're jealous. No, I'm not envious, but they're envious. So they don't like you. They like to, you know, they're trying everything. They'll try everything in their power to, to get you to conform to who they are. Because they they're not really for you. They'll pretend like they're for you. They're not for you. Because they'll start making excuses. They'll start all kinds of justifications. Believe me, dude. I've been there. I've done that. I've seen it. I experienced it. Freaking, you know, all kinds of relationship problems last year, dude. Freaking house burned down. Everything from that one event. And guess what? Still dealing still dealing with problems. Still dealing with it. But guess what? That's part of of reality. That's part of what's going on behind the scenes. The true people who freaking love you, who are there for you, because you know I freaking appreciate you guys. <laughs> I ain't saying this to like, you know, to, to be hard on other people. I'm saying this to, see, the wrong people, they're going to click away from this. They can't stand it. Oh, I can't stand that guy. I can't stand the way that guy is. Why? Because they're too insecure. They can't handle this high energy. This energy is too powerful. The creator said, right here, chosen, this one's chosen, hand-picked from a freaking lineage, from a bloodline. They don't build mindsets like me no more, baby. Guaranteed. <laughs> Dang, dude. And so guess what? You got to decide who you want to be, where you want to go, and you got to let no one take you off your confidence. This is why it's important to not to make your confidence the person you are inside, who you believe you are inside. If you believe you're not worth the effort, guess what? You ain't going to put in the effort. If you don't believe you're worth the value, guess what? You ain't going to have value. You see what I'm saying here? A lot of people, they don't know that. And so they sit back and they try and make you jealous. They try and play games with you and it's like, get what? What do you, what do you think you're doing? Because, there, see, it's energy. And so this is why it's different. Because the energy will come right in and you don't even know it, and it'll start affecting you. This is how it goes. This is how energy is. It's invisible, dude. It come right in. Next thing you know, you're taking on all that stuff. You're dealing with all that negativity. You're dealing with all their insecurity. You're dealing with all their, you know. It's narcissistic, man. Believe me. That's what it is. It's a narcissist. That's what, that's what they do. They gaslight you. All kinds of stuff, man. Believe me. That's why I talk about what I talk about. Because guess what? You got to break away, dude, and take yourself to higher places, baby. <laughs> you have to. Only if you want to be successful. You can't allow these other energies to... And that's why I refer to it as energies because people don't know. I didn't know. It's just energy controlling us and it's controlling us at a subconscious level. So a lot of people, they're just acting out of a subconscious... You know, a subconscious feeling without even knowing that it's the subconscious that's you know, triggering them or making them feel that way. But because once you learn to wake up, once you learn to recognize what's going on in your subconscious mind, dude, you understand that you're going to see, I, I, I see reality different because I see reality from the subconscious mind and the conscious mind. Most people, they're reacting from the subconscious mind, but seeing reality from the conscious mind. What are you talking about, Luke? <laughs> what are you talking about, dude? This is what I'm talking about. Your conscious mind can only handle about 40 bits of data per second. That's it. Your subconscious mind is a 40 million bit processor. And it breaks down and understands all the information around you at 40 million times the capacity of 40. You see the difference? Your subconscious mind is keeping your heart pumping. It's keeping your blood flowing. It's circulating making you breathe, your lungs are expanding, it's filtering your blood, but not all, not all the invisible function that you don't got to consciously think about to keep it pumping and going, but it stores all your memories. It stores all your beliefs. It stores all those patterns of recognition and patterns of experience that you create over time. <laughs> yeah, buddy. It's what it does, baby. This is what it does. And so, because it stores all that, guess what? That becomes the database that you're working with. It's just that most people, they're not aware of that. So when they feel a certain way, they don't know why they're feeling a certain way. Or when they're feeling sad or depressed or this or that, I get it, dude. It sucks. 
but you got to learn. You got to learn how to freaking boss up your motivation. I'm not talking about angry. I I don't walk around all angry, dude. I'm freaking cool with everyone. <laughs> I'm cool with everyone. But see, this kind of what it does when you're real confident and positive like that, real enthusiastic buddy. When you got that that freaking charisma, dude. Guess what, dude? It's gonna make them doubt themselves. And it's not that you're trying to make them doubt. You're just who you are, and by default, they start doubting themselves. And so they don't like it, so they start reacting by, oh, I just didn't like the way he said that. Oh, I just don't like that guy. Oh, that guy just annoys me. That's what that's what happens. But that's not what you're trying to do. <laughs> and so you got to understand, baby, the kind of energy you possess when you start because of the person you become. You start to possess a freaking torch of light, a torch of truth, a torch of torch of amazing possibilities and positivity this is why this is why i talk about success this is why i talk about these awareness laws because most people they ain't aware of these invisible laws dude (laughs) yeah buddy baby but that's it champions that's all i got for you guys today i just wanted to rock a video share some insights on the power of attraction dude what to expect when you start to grow your electromagnetic field of possibilities right all the right people, they're going to be attracted towards you. But you still got to be aware. You still can't just allow anyone to just, you know, come in and be around you. Because next thing you know, guess what, dude? You still, you know, if they have bad intentions towards you, if they have ill intentions towards you, guess what? They're going to try to give that to you. They're going to try to take it out on you. They're going to try and blame you. This is what happens. <laughs> Dang, dude, but that's it, champions. That's all I got for you guys today. Check it out, my friends. If you guys are new here to the YouTube channel, you guys dig this style of amazingness, this style of information, consider subscribing, baby, because I jaw drop amazingness and share this information with like-minded people. You want to learn how to be successful? You want to learn how to rock your confidence? Not ego, not arrogance, not, oh, I'm better than you are, let me one-up you. This is what a lot of people do. They don't even know it. Because they've all they've only been they've only learned to become that kind of person over time. So by default, they they just carry that kind of information with them. So when they start learning this, the only thing they have to work with is the identity that they've already built, which is usually always guaranteed because this is how society is is always ego, pride, envy, jealousy, negativity. Life sucks. And then it goes down, depression, anger, fear, worry. You got to stop caring what other people think about you. I know a lot of people, that might sound harsh, but you can't control them. This is what I've learned. People are going to treat you the way they're going to treat you. People are going to like you. You're going to have all kinds of stuff go on. You're going to have people who say they love you. They don't. They're just playing games. They'll just It's just a matter of time. Or they're just around you know, trying to ride your coattail to success or wait it out. Because in reality, they have other things going on. And so they'll try and, you know, they'll they'll have all these whatever. They're going to do what they're going to do. You cannot worry about it. You can only worry about you and your intentions and what you're doing. Because I know I'm a freaking good person. I don't care what anyone says. The creator knows, dude. <laughs> yeah, buddy, baby. But that's it, champions. That's all I got for you guys today. But I do thank you guys, and I do look forward to talking to you champions again next time, baby. Peace. (laughs) Yeah, buddy, baby. When you get honest with yourself, when you get sincere with yourself, when you truly, truly know what you want, you're going to know the people who truly want to be with you. Not just be with you, but really, energetically be with you. See, a lot of people, they'll want to be around you because they're with you, but their, their energy, they're not really with you. They're, with, they're completely disconnected. And so, just understand that, baby. Understand that you already carry a power of attraction with you. And as that tr- attraction power grows, so does your success. <laughs> so does your success. So, so does everything that you're working towards. And that's why you can't let no one take you off of your success. That's why nothing that happens to me will ever stop me from, t- from success. Ever, ever, ever. <laughs> because I've seen the other side, and the other side, it, it's all messed up. It's all problematic. It, it's not full of solutions. It's full of problems. And then over time, you just, oh, oh well, who cares? Life sucks. This is all I get. <laughs> yeah, buddy, baby. 
done, dude. Boom.